I look like I just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the shirt don't help, but still. Nah. All right, you guys, so we are back. This is a new day. This is actually the day of the baby shower, so we are doing a lot of last minute decorations. Um, so I'm gonna start off back with uh, what she left off on. Uh, these flowers here going along with the vase next to the chairs. Also right here on the other side. Now I'm going to show you guys what I and working on so if you can see the seal in here this is supposed to mimic you know the forest and trees and whatnot still got my ladder going uh, still got a lot more to do right now I am cutting up these streamers I'm gonna try to do a floor a ceiling look so that this whole entire fo foyer will look like a big tree so this is the entryway here all right so I don't got much more time to finish so wish me luck Okay, you guys, so before everything gets started, I wanted to give you guys a quick view of what we did. All right, so we're going to turn the camera around, okay? So as you come in, this is the foyer. <laughs> we're coming in here. The rest of the foyer. So it's supposed to mimic a jungle, trees and whatnot. Kind of ran out of time. We would have probably got this section over here too. Uh, and then we end up here, in presence here. Right of the tree. We have our king and queen chair here. This is where we'll be opening up the gifts. Still setting up, but here we have the dessert table. Dessert table here, the grass wall, flower wall. Looks like we have marshmallow treats, cookies, cake, pops, cake, cookies. And these are going to be filled up with liquor and non-liquor. Um, so this is the dining table here with the grass runner. We painted a lot the animals you saw earlier that we painted. Painted gold here. And this is the dining table. Outside. We just have a bunch of tables with the green and white tablecloths. So this is how everything turned out. Y'all seen her before. She ain't nobody child. But yeah. Look at this. She over here trying to get this stuff. But yeah. <laughs> I didn't make it. Who made it? It's the elder. <laughs> it's yeah. It's the elder. It was strong. She ain't put all the juice in there. It's strong. Okay. Well, it's good. That's all that matters. So this is the uh, everything how it turned out, and it turned out really good. This is the baby's name. I should probably get one sandwich before there be no sandwiches left. Hey babe. Y'all ready? Hey babe. Are, are, you, are they undressing them and they're One is undressing and one dressing. <laughs> okay, y'all ready? Let's go. Mark, set, go. All right, all right. <laughs> go fast, the little man. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Good 
Don't make me start all the names. That's perfect for you. What is that? What is that? It's a, ooh, a planner. A planner? That's perfect for Zoe. We need two more people. Two more people. Vanilla almond bath soap. I'm gonna be smelling good. Nice. That's how you play. You the a one. Okay. Go. Go. Start. They're falling through my fingers. Keep going. 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 Keep Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Yeah, you won. How many you got? You won the bird box challenge. <laughs> Ready, set, go. go. All right. Chug, 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 chug. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, turn up. Oh, turn up. Oh, turn up. You what? You what? I'm about to say my shirt green. What I look like on you, Lavelle? Might be too short. Hold on. Uh oh. That might be close. Uh oh. It might be close. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> How many inches do you think that is? <laughs> you're, 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 you're gonna be too short. Jimmy, what you got? Unknown <laughs> factor. <laughs> Jerome. Mama. Mama's close. So mama's pretty close. Mama's close. Call your stomach in. Call your stomach in now. Oh, 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 oh. No. No. A little too big. No, that's too big. Sorry. Next time. <laughs> Who 
loves it. Who's the winner? Who's the winner? Yeah. It's like she knew what it was, so this is a so if anybody didn't figure out the name yet, it's Nala. Nala is from the Lion King 2. She's the Simba's wife. Uh, so that's kind of got me into this, this lion. White? Baby wipes. Yeah. Baby wipes. John, how long is this gonna last? Baby wipes. One. Oh, that's right there. That's about. We get a hat. Okay. <laughs> right. That's four days. Yeah. Why well, I feel like it's the first week. Right. <laughs> progressive. Yeah, day this is kind of digressive. Yes. There it is. <laughs> the more the merrier. And he got that secure grip. Yeah, I know. Ain't rolling off. All right. So it is the end of the baby shower. I'm sorry if it's like really choppy or whatnot. I'm not really sure how everything turned out as far as filming and everything, but David has done an awesome job trying to keep up with filming. So let's just hope for the best, but everything turned out beautifully and all my friends were dope. They cleaned up the hallway, as you can see her over there cleaning up or whatever so this is literally look 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 at her literally everything but as you can see for one last time her name is nala nala, nala amina isaac so we're just kind of cleaning up wrapping things up i'm really winded really tired it's time to go so thank you guys for watching that was the baby shower and i will see you and i love you thank you so much for helping me out she pretty dope look at her makeup she was trying to be cute yeah, yeah. look better than me hi you guys so i just want to pop in really quickly before i officially ended off the baby shower video i was sitting here editing and i realized that there was some components of this shower Ooh, i got paint on my hair child ignore that but anyway there were some components of the baby shower as far as my DIYs that I didn't get a chance to explain because everything was going by so fast, had so much to do. And you know, it's just really hectic when you're planning your own baby shower and trying to get stuff done, especially if you're a crafty person like me. So what I decided to do is come to the end of this video and kind of explain a little bit more of some of the DIYs that I did and show it a little bit better that wasn't really explained explained due to having a short period of time and one of those things was the hallway which was one of my favorite part of the baby shower David did show it in the beginning of this video but it was kind of quick for my liking you know what I'm saying I'm not gonna get into too much but um I really do appreciate him for filming because if it wasn't for him child we wouldn't have no footage but I wanted to show you guys like I said the hallway and how I did it so I was in the midst of actually putting the hallway back together as you see little glimpses of because I really want to get some photos as well as be able to explain this to you guys. I know there's a lot of people that really want to see how things turned out as far as my crafts. I take a lot of pride in it because of the amount of time and efforts and research that it takes to do it pretty much. So when I was doing my shower, I knew I wanted vines in my hallway. But there wasn't really a lot of videos on what to do to create mine. So I thought I should just take a moment to explain that right now and then show you guys the hallway, explain what I did, how I did it, and so on and so forth. So this is the vines. I absolutely 
love it. I'm about to finish putting the vines on this side as well. Just for a picture's sake. So I have one for Instagram and stuff like that. But this is what the vines look like. And I absolutely love them. I really wanted this look. And this is what it looks like on this side. So what I did on the day of the baby shower. I actually hot glued this to the walls. And made kind of a shape. I would not recommend that. Right now I just actually use clear thumbtacks. Which is like this that you can get at the Dollar Tree and tack them on. As well as these little leave thingies. I got these from Hobby Lobby. Just cut them into pieces and just twirled them around the little vine part. But before we really dig into that part, I really wanted to show you really quickly how I did it. So, vines. Vines is this little thing right here. What I ended up using was craft paper roll. I don't know. I got this literally at the Dollar Tree. It looks like packing paper. So what I do is uh, take a decent piece, rip it. And so I'll do this, kind of crumble it as I do it. And then if I want to start getting longer, I go sideways. So then once I get a good length, I literally start squishing it. Squeeze, squish. Squeeze, squish, twist. And I'll just literally do that back and forth. Then the parts that looks like this, I'll twist the opposite way. I just kind of do the whole thing just to make sure it don't look like crap, basically. And that's pretty much your vine. Don't have to be nothing fancy because, you know, trees have veins in them. So you can shape them up how you want to. And I just like stuff them up like that. And literally one roll of this is a dollar. So you can probably create like maybe like four, like five or six of vines. And right there I only have um, four right there. So I'm going to put one on this side, four, and then probably like two on the opposite side. And that's it. So you got to base it off your own hallway or wherever you're putting it at. You can make a tree out of this and put multiple together to create like a tree bark and then kind of go out type of thing. I will always buy more than less. So the streamers, I bought the light green ones from Walmart because Dollar Tree don't have the light green ones, but they have this dark green ones at the Dollar Tree. This was a dollar for a giant roll and this was a dollar for two medium or medium sized rolls. To do this hallway and clearly we, clearly we didn't do this side but I wasn't gonna buy more just for this video, it wasn't that deep. But <laughs> for my hallway, we used about four bags of the dark green. So when I say bags, the dark green ones come two in a pack, a uh, medium size. So we use four of those to get this much. And we use the clear thumbtacks to pin that up against the wall. If you look closely, they're thumbtacked to the ceiling. If you don't like the idea of thumbtacking, definitely don't do nothing like this. Don't do nothing like this, like it's not that deep. That's what I did as well. This is actually a green tablecloth from Dollar Tree. For this one and this one is one tablecloth. So we literally cut it in half so that the air vent Please don't put this over an air vent if you want to do this yourself because it will suck it up. We cut this in half, made the little bubble there, and I had these leaves from a plant so I just threw them in there and spread them out and make it look like, you know, you're in the jungle. And then that was a separate one by itself. Let me go over there. And we spread it out. We didn't cut it. This is pretty much how... The hallway turned out, I absolutely loved it because when you open the door or when a lot of people was walking by, these streamers would like blow in the wind. And that was so cute. So I'm very proud of this little walkway. I'ma probably show you an end clip when I'm done pinning this side, just so you guys can just see as a whole. 
but I also want to get a good Instagram picture of it. So that's the reason why I'm doing it as well. I think that's pretty much it. The drape that was on this wall, I thumbtacked that to the wall as well. And I just kind of squished the curtain. And then when I did that, it kind of gave that drapery look. I thought I was going to be able to do the balloon thing, but I didn't. And I gave up on life and it was what it was. So yeah, I think that is all for the DIY crafts. I just really wanted a chance to explain that because that was really the biggest part to me. So hope you guys enjoyed watching my baby shower. The baby shower is still absolutely amazing. I had a great time and I don't think it could have went any better. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one.